Ah, camera fell. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, so um, this is a haul on um, poor girl makeup. Um, I'm not saying that like it's a bad thing. I just like to joke around about it. I know um, a lot of people probably shop at like um, Family Dollar, Dollar General, Dollar Tree, places like that. Um, I personally know I do, and once in a while, like I would get stuff from there. Um. So, this is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I did not have enough time to go to Dollar General and Family Dollar. And then there's another one. I can't remember what, what it's even called. Oh, the Wig and Weave store because they sell a lot of good, like, cheap makeup too. So, I only got to go to Dollar Tree. So, this is my Dollar Tree haul. And everything there is a dollar. And out here, Indiana sales tax is like, I think like 5 or 6%. I think it's 6%. So, um, we'll get into it. Um, I got some really good stuff. Um, if you're not into dollar stores or anything, then maybe this isn't the tutorial for you. I don't know. I like them. I find good stuff. Um, so I do, as usual, have my cigarettes and I am, I'm still so exhausted. Just so much has been going on. So I've been like living off of these, um, I actually, on my way, I stopped and I got an amp. I've never had amp before energy drink. And this one is um the uh, Boost Cherry and it has caffeine and um, vitamin B. It's really, really good stuff. As soon as everything calms down and gets straightened out, I'll lay off of those and go back to coffee because coffee just wasn't cutting it. Okay, so first thing I'm going to start with from the Dollar Tree haul is... um. They had these cute, like, little baskets. Um, my makeup brushes, I keep them in a Harajuku girl bag. Um, and it's so hard to dig around to find brushes in there. So, I figured this one would be great for brushes. And then, I had gotten a second one, because they're only a dollar. And they only had two pink ones left. This one's a little bit deformed, but that's okay. Um... It's a hell of a form, but hey, what do you expect for a dollar? Uh, I will figure, um, I don't know, I'll figure some type of makeup to put in it. And once, um, because my makeup is all, like, a huge, horrible mess right now, once I get my makeup all figured out and cleaned and reorganized and everything, I promise you, with my bourgeois thing, I will give an entire makeup, like, review, like, show, like, show you everything that I have, um, just besides the basic stuff that I use, I have more. And I'll give you the grand tour. And plus of all the hair stuff that I have and all of um, the hair accessories and stuff that I have. Okay, so we'll start with the makeup that I got. Um, I didn't take any of it out of the packaging. Let me move a little closer to the camera. Okay, so I got um, LA Colors. Okay, no glare. Okay. And keep in mind, everything was a dollar. Okay, and then I'll tell you um, my grand total at the end. Okay. They're shimmery. Came with, it's LA Colors. Came with three colors. This middle one is like a, like a pink. This is like a green. And this one is like an aqua. And then I got the same thing in LA Colors. And... They're called um, the three color eyeshadow. And it says silky smooth application. Which, and it's long lasting rich intense color. And these, um, this one is like a golden color. This one is like a brown color. This one's kind of almost like a copper color. Sorry if you're getting a glare. Um, I thought these, um, actually inspired me this one to do um a beach look where with the messy hair with a braid going on using this and another palette that I got today and I'll show you that palette that also inspired the beach look um which was this one this is also LA colors this is the 12 color eyeshadow as you can see I hope I'm not getting a terrible glare it's got like the browns, like um, 
like fleshy tones, like some kind of like, I don't know if it's green or what it is, but it's in there. Um, and it says the same thing, long lasting, rich, intense color. This was a dollar. So this one and this one, I'll cover my face. Um, these are what I'm going to do for, um, a beach look um along with the hair it'll be a tutorial um I'm not sure when I'm gonna get to it because I still have to do my false lash tutorial um my 16 and pregnant episode tutorial and um this relationship tutorial thing but I will definitely do the beach thing and then I got um another LA colors 12 color eyeshadow this is just um a bunch of different colors. You can see there's some pinks, greens, yellows, blues, purples, white. A little bit of everything, which is good for summer and spring. Um, they seem to look a little bit more vibrant. There you go on the camera. Um, but they're actually kind of um light in color, but they're still really pretty. And I will find something to do with them. I will probably with this one. Um, I'm, I'm sick of these glares. Okay. But this one, I will probably try to do, um, like the outfit of the day where the outfit kind of goes with the makeup and stuff and do the hairstyle to that type of tutorial with that one. And the last one I got, um, is Color Mates, um, eyeshadow. It's called Tropical Fusion. It's, you can't read it. It's, the writing here is being blocked, but... That's okay. Um, they're like shimmer bars. I don't know if you can see them. I'm getting some wicked little glare here. Sorry, I'm in my bedroom because Mark's in the computer room now. We've been like flip-flopping bedrooms, but you can see it. They're like really pretty shimmer bars. Which, um, some are green, brown, yellowish. You know what, this would also be good for like a beach look or, um... I could also do with this one would be really good is if um like a theme park to look um you know I noticed on Facebook a lot of people talk about going to like Six Flags and doing things like that so I can use this one and um with foundation and stuff and a nice simple hairstyle so that your makeup doesn't run off if you're going to be doing an outside thing, going on rides. I don't do anything like that, but I will do a tutorial on it. So that way for you guys that do outdoorsy things and go to theme parks and are adventurous and stuff like that, you'll have a little tutorial. And um, that was it for the makeup. And they also sell um, makeup remover, remove makeup remover facial wipes and um for dollar 40 came in the bag i don't know if you can see it i'm getting this glare i don't know what the fuck it's coming from but man i am getting a glare um i got that that was a dollar um usually i will use the ponds or the neutrogena ones i just i'm usually always at walgreens so i just pick them up at walgreens but i said hey why not i'm always open to new things i figured i would try that too and then for hair i um I don't know what happens with bobby pins. I don't know if I'm the only one who has a problem. It's like they disappear or someone steals them. I don't know. I'm always losing bobby pins. But anyways, so for a dollar, I got 72 bobby pins, which is a good deal. And then also, um, I had showed in a haul a cute yellow top that I got. And I got, like, quite a few yellow tops for, like, the summer and spring. And I saw these um, two hair clips was two of them and they were only a dollar so I figured they were cute and simple you know to do you any kind of hairstyle just flip one flip clip one of these in and you're good to go they only had them in yellow if they would have had see you're getting there's a glare but there you go if they would have had them in um other colors I probably would have gotten them would have gotten more most definitely and then they had some fun socks there um I, I highly doubt anyone ever did showed socks on a tutorial, but I just, um, seen these ones that they have 
cherries on them. And I thought they were so cute because I like to wear skinny jeans with flats. Um, like whatever color like corresponds. I don't have green flats, but I have pink ones and I have black ones. And it's cute when the socks show. I think like in the springtime, like around this time, call me weird, but I like to do that. I think that is like so cute. And even the, in the winter, um, I know Paul Frank makes the really thicker ones that work great with the flats too. I've done that and I've got so many compliments on it. So that's a little fashion thing that people can try. I got them at the dollar store and then I got these ones to get the full effect. I'm going to have to open them. And it was the last pair and I think someone hid them. And I like when people hide stuff and I find them. Stuff they hide. Not them, but you know, the stuff they hide. Because it's like usually the last one. I do it all the time too. But um, they're black. I don't know if you can see them. They're black and polka dotted. And they say little devil. I, I don't know. You're probably getting the glare. Okay, they say little devil. With the hearts, these I couldn't really do with a pair of flats because I would want the little devil part to show. But I guess the polka dot part could show if, um, I know I want to do a rockabilly, um, tutorial. Maybe I can use these socks with a pair of flats. Not sure, but, um, that was pretty much my Dollar Tree haul. I spent at Dollar Tree, um, I gave the chick a 20 and I got a dollar and some change back. I had also bought a few other things, um, just for the house or whatever. But yeah, so it was a pretty good haul. Um, that way, um, when, um, I would, let me restart myself here. I would like to get comments and whatnot on responses from, um, if anyone sees a difference from the makeup that I use from Ulta and Sephora, the drugstore makeup or the dollar store makeup and um if anyone notices difference negative positive put it and also if you want to rate it that would be great too so then that way people have a general idea um I usually give my personal opinions but I'd like other people to put their opinions out there as well too I think it's a good idea um so I'm gonna end it here that was my Dollar Tree haul and, um, I am most certain, oh, there's a shadow, huh? Okay, I am most certain that I will definitely be seeing you guys again. I hope you enjoyed this short little dollar store haul. And, um, I am uploading a video now, so hopefully the, um, drugstore makeup look, so hopefully, drugstore hairstyle makeup look, so hopefully... That one will be up maybe tonight or tomorrow, so look for it. Um, I'm not sure. I got some stuff to do around the uh, house. Well, not really stuff, but, like, I got to watch my movie, The Vow. I haven't watched it yet, or I might go to sleep. I don't know. So keep an eye out for that tutorial, and I will see you all later.